Hey guys. Colin here. Good to see you. Haven't been here in a, at least a couple days. I guess that's a win for you guys. Wasn't going to do this video. I was waiting for Mark Tinsky that I bought from him from his shop. But got this the other day. I'll just hold it up. I don't want to risk labels showing. My friend, baseball pipe guy. I don't. I, he's David to me. My friend sent me this box of goodness. And I asked him, can I hold it until my Tinsky gets here? It's Saturday. I was hoping that my Tinsky would get here today. It didn't. I can't wait on that box. I want to see what's inside of it. And I owe it to him uh, for his kindness to get this done today and let you guys see the goodness that he shared with me. But I got these other boxes that I'm going to try and make kind of quick. Today's opener, the SOG Trident. Let's get after it. A couple boxes of goodness. Uh, both of these boxes are from Four Noggins, uh, which means I'm gonna have some delicious soy, cheesy flavored, cheesy poofs. Cheesy poofs for me to eat. Except I'm not gonna eat them again because they suck ass. But at least they're not shitty styrofoam ones that taste horrible as well. Um, so two quick, I'm gonna try and make them quick. I don't want you guys to have to sit here all week. And I really want you to see what uh, what David sent me. So I'm gonna go through these pretty darn quick. Um, a lot of tobacco. This is my last giant order. I say that now, I'm a fucking liar. I'll probably order a bunch of shit later. So put that one aside. Oh, that one actually must be Pipes and Cigars because it doesn't have delicious soy flavored soy treats in it. So here's my tobaccos, four ounces. Proper English. Don't remember who mentioned it. Thought it looked wonderful. I ordered it. Uh, I know who mentioned this one. Got two of them because I know this guy knows what he's talking about. Rat Ray's Retray. I can't pronounce it. I'm not fancy. Sterling Flake times two. Looking forward to that one. Exciting. I'm going to say looking forward a lot because that's what we do when we get tobaccos. I'm looking forward to trying this because I actually am. Trying to find some other thing to say. Capstan Flakes. Again, don't remember, probably saw that some picture of that somewhere and decided it was the greatest thing on earth and now I own it. Capstan Blue. I think that was from the Pipe Smoke Forum. Somebody posted that up and talked about how wonderful that was. So I was like, well, yeah, I guess I need to own that now. Uh, a couple of packs of tapered pipe cleaners. You can never have enough of those and I try to keep my pipes clean because I'm otherwise not super clean with my stuff. That's what my wife helps me with. Bunch more pipe cleaners. Yippee. Uh, old Gallery. Retrays. Another ten of that. Cornell and Deal's Sunday Picnic. Don't remember where I saw that. Thought it looked good. I always check the reviews just to see what they're going to be like. I'm flying through this. I'm sorry, but I really want to open David's box. Patriot Flake. Another one that I that, uh, that Alec Eastern Gray recommended along with the Sterling Flake. Um... And if he likes it, I'm sure I'm going to like it. Flying. Flying. Oh, I'm going to show you this too. This is like a speed reader video. Ordered this for all you guys that talk me into it. I believe you. I trust in you. I got a kick-ass Celtic cross on there. This is my Zippo Fluid Zippo. This is, this is going to tell you a lot about me, this next box. I read an article in Pipes and Tobacco Magazine. It was a article written in the back of the magazine. Some the guy was like recommending a bunch of tobaccos and talking about them. And this is how easy you can get me. Just talk about something, and I'm gonna order it. This one is old limey bastard. This is not from that article. I believe another one that Alec may have recommended. But I read this article on pipes and tobacco, and I thought, and I wrote actually wrote this stuff down. So, red repery, also retrays. Every review of that's fantastic. Somebody recently opened a tin of that and showed it off. This one's strangely interesting to me. Also, uh, Bradley from Stuff and Things just got one of these Orientals from McClellan. I'm going to show you this one. This is Yaniji Highlander. Also in that article. That one's a little bit more shaky for me. We'll see, but it sounded fascinating in the article, so that guy writes really well. Retrays Black Mallory, also written in that article. Also fascinating to me. One of my new favorites that I had at the Outer Banks, Old Dark Fired, also freaking delicious. 
White Knight, stumbled into that one. It happened to become available somewhere. Somebody posted it on one of the Facebook pages. I said, yay me. Yay my bank account. Uh, Retrace Highland Targ. I just think that's an effing cool tin. I'm not cussing now because my daughter's creeping behind me. I would have cussed. You know what I would have said. The F thing. But I didn't because she's back there, my seven-year-old. Hi, Megan. She's eating cheesy poofs, but they're not cheesy poofs. She's actually got the styrofoam ones. Jackknife plug. Uh, uh, Jay Piper. I hope I got that right. Mentioned this one. I think Bradley might have shown this one recently. Looking forward to this one. Look at there. I did it again. I said looking forward. All right. Another really quick box because I seriously want to give uh, props to my brother, David, for sending me goodness. Baseball pipe guy, you roll. This is an estate pipe. By estate, I mean somebody got it, smugged it one time, and was like, hey, let's put that on YouTube. Or YouTube. What am I talking about? See how fast I'm talking? Crazy talk. This is a David Jones. Smoked once, according to eBay. Can you trust eBay? I guess I'll find out. So, this is a David Jones. Obviously far smaller than my last David Jones. Um... I'm not going to put it in my mouth because I need to sanitize it, even though it, shit, I don't think it, it might have had a bowl, little chatter on the stem, but I'll just turn that over and nobody will notice, oh, there's a little bit on that side, but I will have a bit uh, softy on it anyway, so nobody cares. Look at that gem. David Jones makes some jewel pipes. My uh, Dublin that I got from him smokes like a chimney. It's gigantic. I can load like a whole tin in there. Uh, this one is, it's a Levat. I love the Levat shape. It's just classic style. This one's pretty blasted. Uh, starting to get into smooth ones. These old classical. I'm seriously, not, I want to put this in my mouth, but I noticed somebody's Funkadelic is on there, and it's going to get all in my teeth that are already kind of screwed up anyway or mixed into my beautiful beard that I just trimmed down. So, there is my newest David Jones. Again, I'm flying because I got like eight minutes left. I don't want to keep you guys over 15 minutes because you guys will hate me. So, quickly, into my friend, Baseball Pipe Guys, Goodness and kindness to me. I had it most of the way open, and then I saw the note inside, and I stopped myself. So I really wanted that Tinsky. This is the requisite bro note from my bro. Hi, Megan. Oh, oh, he wrote like a tome. Finally, all this stuff I've been waiting for has arrived. It's hard trying to put together a box full of Becky that you don't already have. So hope I was successful. I'm sure you were, brother. Anything is greatly appreciated and I will treasure it. Can't tell you how nice it's been getting to know you and I look forward to a long friendship. Likewise, my brother. Uh, I just tried Sleepy Hollow this morning. It was absolutely delicious, which means I'm sure there's some of that in there. Hope you enjoy it. All included a few things that I haven't even tried. Is this writing Balkan Super Well? I don't want to read that because they're in there. So, without further ado, thanks, Megs. I'll see you later, honey. Don't trip. First up, John Bull, Royal English. That's pretty cool. That pouch is freaking awesome. You see that? That big, angry... I think he probably thought I looked like this guy. <sighs> pretty close. That's, this whole box is, I'm sure, going to smell delicious. Next up. Got to read the writing. At least he writes better. Oh. See? Giants Blend. That, I believe, is David's own personal blend from Pipes and Cigars. It's going to smell like dirty giant socks. No, it actually smells pretty good. Orioles guy. Thanks, Megan. Sleepy Hollow. I'm excited about this one. It's an arrow. I'm trying to veer away from arrows or not veer towards arrows, but I love the ones that I've gotten, and this one apparently is magical. Apparently it was limited release. Somebody said, hey, you guys can buy it for a day, and people went shithouse. Oh. People went really crazy and ordered a bunch of it. Um, and I don't blame you because I'm sure the reviews of this are also fantastic. It's another one of those mythical. I can't even see. There's so much stuff sitting here. It's like creeping into the picture. Uh, next up, Union Terminal. I have no idea what this is. Um, interesting. I'm not even sure what's in that. I'm going to hit my tobacco reviews when I'm done with this. I don't mean to throw it like that. I'm not diminishing it. I just... Oh. Nice. Margate. My first esoterica. 
I'm gonna smell this one and I'm gonna take my time because I got like four minutes and some change. So you will sit and watch with me while I smell a bag. I will smell a bag. I'm not afraid to smell a bag. Oh, that's nice and smoky. I like that. My daughter thinks that's funny. Look, it's seriously. I'm gonna be like not in the picture in a minute. Empty bag. I don't know where this one came from. Next up. Thank you, my dear. Balkan Supreme. That's awesome. Man, he sent me good chunks of these, too. Uh, though he and I have been buying, like, like we could open our own tobacco sales business and probably still have plenty left. Next up. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Uh, I think he mentioned getting this uh, from Shane, Big Flakes 88. You're the man. He didn't give me too much of it so as to give me a nice solid flake that I'm going to load up and enjoy. Another Esoterica blend that I'm super excited about. Thank you, Shane. Thank you, David. Next up is HH Latakia Flake. He knows that I liked a lot of Kias. Uh, I had a uh, Perik experience with a Cool Hand Fluke, which I mentioned before, that about burnt my face off. So I've been kind of a little bit nervous. I like that. I was just noticing that. I bet Shane wrote that. That is smooth. Nice work. Uh, had a bad experience with that Perique, and I'm a little bit leery of it right now. The Everybody's Going After It tobacco right now. Dark Strong Kentucky. A whole tin of it. You the man. You the man. Have I gotten through it, Megan? Is that my... Is that my... That's my cat Yoshi. There's Yoshi. Cat Yoshi's probably going to scratch my face off. Okay, Max, thanks. So I'm going to sit these up here. Listen. Uh, I know I'm flying. I know you've seen a thousand things. None of this, none of the early ones mean as much to me as what uh, what David has shared with me. Um, I guys never met me. We've interwebs chatted. Um, we've watched each other's videos. We've learned from each other. That's what this is about to me. Uh, I can buy tobaccos all day long, but to have some guy who's never met me, who's all the way across the country from me, send me good stuff like not just shitty go oh, sorry crappy tobaccos uh you know they're like yeah i don't want that that sucks i'll send it to this guy I, it means a ton to me and that's what this community is about to me this is my first uh gifting from anybody i've met on here uh, i i can't tell you how much i appreciate it how cool i think it is that we do this for each other uh, that you do it for each other, uh, that we're all in this together. Um, it's just cool. It's cool stuff. It's such a great hobby. I got a VR done to me today about uh, my tongue bite video, my last one up. Uh, that's the kind of stuff that I think is just cool. Cats that have never met me, have never talked to me, have will probably will never meet me unless I can get to the left coast uh, or maybe we'll meet at a show or something. Um, it's just fantastic. It's fantastic that you guys do this for each other, that it's been done for me, that I will return the favor, uh, that you guys have these these contests, the VRs, uh, Birdman's contest, where all you got to do is link your channel. Uh, you know, it's cool. It, it's, it, it touches me. Um, I, it's something I never expected. I, I have I had all kinds of hobbies in my life. I've shown you a bunch of them. Uh, this, this is the first time that... Uh, that uh, a community has been so giving and so kind with each other, and I appreciate that. I appreciate what you guys are all doing for each other. Uh, I thank you, David, Baseball Pipe Guy. If you guys have not hit his channel, hit his channel. I say hit in the punny way because it's a Baseball Guy channel. So, David, thank you. Four Noggins, thank you for being open for business. eBay, thanks for being there so I can buy another pipe. That puts me at 11, and my Tinsky should be here shortly. I'll do a video for that. Um, okay, Max. I'll do a video for that when it gets here, so it'll be much shorter than this. Anyhow, thanks for hanging with me for almost 15. I don't want to get all the way to 15, so thank you. See you next round, brothers and sisters.